Hi seniors, this is Eric Dar from OmniFit and today I want to make a great video all about upper body strength. You may be wondering why upper body strength? Well, upper body strength is crucial for pretty much everything we do. If you live pretty much every day, you need upper body strength to do your daily activities. So that's what we're going to focus on today. So let's get into it. So when it comes to exercise to build upper body strength, we want to focus on three ones and they all have to do with pushing, pulling, and lifting. I have a bonus one at the end, but let's focus on those three first. So when it comes to pushing, when it comes to pushing for seniors, we want to do a pushing movement, which a great one is, is a bench press. So as you see me doing right here, Lie on your back, find a bench, find a chair, find something you can put your back on, or use the floor if you don't have any of the above. Take two weights where you can do about 12 to 15 reps and push right over your chest. The great thing about a bench press is it works your whole, pretty much your whole front side of your upper body, your chest, your arms, your shoulders. So when it comes to pushing, do a bench press. Okay, next we want to focus on pulling and I want to spend extra attention on pulling and the reason why, as I've done in previous videos, is for seniors, pulling is probably even more important than pushing because our back side of our body gets less work than the front side and when it comes to things like our posture, we need to pull probably twice as much as we push. A great exercise for pulling is a row. So if you have a access to a gym, you can use a rowing machine or you can use a seated row. If you don't have any, take a band, wrap it around something and pull. It's great, great, great just to work your backside of your body. So secondly, let's focus on a pull. So when it comes to the third movement, it's all about lifting. So I have to make this little exception. If you have any issues with your shoulders, maybe this is the one you skip. But why lifting is great is, let's be honest, if we have to go and put something on a shelf, on a bookcase, we have to carry something, we need our shoulders, we need to be able to lift things, particularly if we live at home and we're independent. So lifting is very crucial. For that, we can do a shoulder press. Shoulder presses are great exercises for lifting, but if you have shoulder issues, this is the uh, modification. Maybe just do a shoulder fly. A shoulder fly is where we take our weights and spread our arms to the side. Much easier on the shoulders if you can't do a shoulder press. Point number three. So point number four, folks, you may see a container in my hand and one underrated part of strength, this is your bonus one by the way, underrated thing we need strength for is grip strength as seniors. Seniors typically lose grip strength as they get older. So being able to open cans, bottles, or jars, or anything that has a top on it is crucial. Let me show you. Okay, I need a little bit more strength for this one. So opening tops, crucial for grip strength. And if you don't have it, this is where you get into a little bit of a trouble as we get older. So folks, what do you think about those three points, pushing, pulling, lifting, and the bonus one, which is basically grip strength. What do you think about those folks? Do you struggle in any of those categories? If you do, focus on these movements, folks. So folks, upper body strength, crucial. We need to work on it as seniors. On that note, that's it for today. If you folks have any comments, please like and subscribe at the bottom of this video. This is Eric Dahl from Mommy Fit. Take care.